and Eamon, before the match, you, you, you picked Real over the two games, weren't really sure about tonight. Do you think now with that late goal, have Real got the upper hand? Uh, they'd be favourites now to go on because Boateng and Robin have both left and they're important players. But it's a game that was curiously lacking in intensity compared to, say, last night. And Real were happy enough to sit and wait. And they saw Bayern off. After 20 minutes, Madrid started to get into the game, were passing the ball well and creating some dangerous chances. The goal came out of the blue uh, and it was an amazing goal. Goalkeeping error, also a defensive error. Uh, so, uh, and Madrid back in it. I think Madrid are a much better team particularly with Boateng, who's key, and Robin off the pitch. Mm, OK, and as George said on commentary, goals from uh, two full-backs. Damien, here's Kimmich's one after 27 minutes. <laughs> yeah, as much as it's a great ball from James, Real Madrid will be kicking themselves. The ball went out of place, came back in from the keeper, and they just never got back into shape. They, they more or less slept. Uh, and again, we've, we've touched on Navas, uh, the keeper, before. He's nearly cost him in the quarterfinals, and... And he's cost him a big goal here tonight. Uh, listen, Hamas has done really well this season. He's on a, a, a two-year loan from Madrid. Kimmich, listen, he's ran Marcelo into the ground, but you know, it's gone straight down the straight down the barrel here. He's just gone down too early. Why I don't know. And uh, listen, this is why Real Madrid every year flirting with David De Gea. Uh, it's as simple as that. So. Um, listen, it's been a chess match, a very slow chess match, uh, so to speak. But uh, Real Madrid with the away goal are in the ascendancy. Yeah. Marcel, oh, sorry, did he? Mean it. That was a cross. I'm, I'm sure he wanted okay. to play the ball to Lewandowski. Keeper is guessing, uh, yeah, he's, he's got to stand his ground, he's got to do better. Because Navas initially made a move left and then went right as if he's expecting the cross. Yeah, he's expecting the cross and I'm sure if you look at Kimi, we probably see it after the we game were, again. Yeah. Um, you know, he's looking at the Ribéry and Lewandowski in the middle. He, I'm pretty sure there was a cross. All right, let's have a look at Marcelo's equaliser. Close to half-time, Didi. Yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a good move. It's one of the few times they really got into the uh, Munich half. It's a good ball into Mar from Marcello. Uh, Isco uh, defends the ball um, and then they switch to play um, and actually I think that the, the, it's not really a good ball by Cavalli and I think Martinez is put off because he thinks uh, Ronaldo is going for the overhead kick again and this is why he's, he's, he's kind of put off, it doesn't clear the ball, uh, it falls to Marcello and it's, uh, yeah, it's just a perfectly hit ball into the far corner, no chance for the keeper and uh, yeah, maybe a bit fortunate at this time of the of the game because Munich had one or two chances to make it 2-0. Um, but yeah, you can never write them off. You know, they suck you in, they soak up pressure and then they hit you. Okay, guys, for the moment, thanks.